All right. We are 16-12. We're probably going to drop after this. Somebody explain to me the Dawn Fan thing. Um, ooh, we got Weather Bats, yo. I definitely see Weather Bats. Um, I also see... I also see Cresselia being amazing in this fight here. Well, we're definitely starting Lando. And Cresselia. In the back... We've got like four of the same Pokémon, but the other two makes a huge difference. He doesn't have flinches. I shouldn't bring a Moongus. I don't think it's going to help me anyways. So, Heatran, and then which Mega? Which Mega do we bring? Which Mega is going to be better for us here? <sighs> if I can beat Heatran... If I can beat the Heatran, then Charizard's not terrible here. Let's see. I think I should bring Kang. I'm gonna bring Kang. Does anybody know why Ice Shard failed? I don't understand. <laughs> I am so shocked, I don't know. And he goes Landorus, right? Nope, he went for the bat. Okay. Um, I don't know who he's going to be faking outing. So, I'm just going to throw rocks. I'm going to throw rocks. Throw rocks and... He might Tailwind here. Tailwind would be an issue, especially if Kang gets us. So I'm gonna paralyze the Kang. <clears throat> I am super confused. It might have something to do with Don Fan's item. Does Don Fan have an item that makes it so that he can't do things? Oh, the taunt! So good. So good! So smart. Okay, so I can't talk. Okay, well, he didn't go for the Tailwind, so I'm just gonna Ice Beam him this turn. And I should be okay. Yeah, he withdraws the Kang. Does he bring in Landorus? No, he brought in Heatran. Interesting. Sunny day then. Some decent damage. Went for the Tailwind instead. Okay. Hank <laughs> He's so cute. Get that ice beam. Do do do. And... Wow, I still didn't knock him out. I'm still under no threat by any of his Pokemon. So... I'm just gonna keep throwing rocks. Oh. He's definitely going to Sunny Day this turn. And then, like, Heat Wave, I think. <sighs> so I'm going to throw rocks to knock out the, the Batty Bat, and then bring in my Heatran to absorb the Heat Wave. I don't have time to wait for the, uh, the Taunt to wear off. I'm pretty sure it said Ice Shard though. I'm pretty sure it said Ice Shard. Oh my god, I survived. Oh, but I got burned. But I fell through the rocks. Wait, who did I miss? I missed a Heatran, okay good. I don't care, I just wanna get rid of that bat. That bat drives me insane. Hey, I'm alive, cool. I will preserve you, sir. Who's your last, oh no, he's brought King back. That's a pretty easy switch out on my part here. Bring in the Cress. And protect Heatran. And then I'll sack the Lando and get a T-Wave off on the Heatran. 
then I don't have to worry about uh, I'm I was so convinced he was a weather bat uh, so if I do that get that off knock out. Uh, I'll get my citrus activated so it won't knock out. Yay! Hooray for not dying. Hmm. It's pretty painful. Not gonna lie guys, pretty painful. Get spat on. I still don't know what his last Pokemon is, and that's a problem. But his Tailwind Peter's out. Gotta bring in my Kang. Threaten the Fake Out. So he has to protect the Heatran. Get healed up a little bit. He's got Low Kick. We confirmed that much. Um... He's already at minus one. So he's probably gonna switch out. He's got fake out, so I'm gonna safely power up punch into this Kang. He might fish for things. Yeah, good. Goody goody gum drops. Ooh, that's scary. Will he can't protect, so he might just go for the attack. That will suck. But nothing else we can really do about that. Yeah. Went for the low kick, huh? Interesting. I feel amazingly strong. I was really hoping he'll set up sun for me so that I can heal like amazing amounts, but this will do. So most likely he's gonna rage powder and then try to finish off my Kang at this point. Um, realistically, I could try to Ice Beam to finish off his Kang. I don't even think Ice Beam's gonna knock out his Kang, um, but it would do some good damage. Hmm. Call mine or should I ice beam? I think I'm gonna ice beam the Kang and protect my Kang. Let's see if he goes for the Rage Powder move. I'm assuming he will go for Rage Powder and then try to knock out my Kang. Yep. He went for Sucker Punch! I am shocked. I did pretty good damage there, with a crit though. Hmm. I wonder if he'll go for a Sucker Punch again. I'm gonna calm mind up. He pretty much has to Rage Powder here. And I think he's faster than I am as well. Pretty much reveal what I have though. I think he's gonna straight up attack me. But I don't really have a choice. I'm just gonna go for the return. Oh, he withdraws! Oh my god, this is amazing! And it's a heat train, okay? Rage Powder is gonna try and knock me out with uh, Rocky Helmet. It might actually knock me out with Rocky Helmet. Uh, okay, one Rocky Helmet. We're living, we're living. Now the threat is real. So the question is, 
Does he fake out the Crest or does he fake out the Kang? I feel like he almost cannot afford to fake out into Kang. But it's pretty safe for me to Thunder Wave the Kang and protect anyways. And then after this I can Sucker Punch every single turn if, I, if he doesn't fake out. No, he went... Yeah. I knew he was going to do it too. Man, I'm such a scrub. Oh, he's going to try to knock out the crest. So smart. Oh my gosh. I totally botched that. I live! Okay. I live. Moonlight. And I can sucker punch the Kang because he... He's going to try for it, right? He still had it. He still had a chance if I misplay, but he's going to just give up. I'm shocked. 